I want to welcome uh, President Benson to the United States of America and to the Oval Office. Uh, last year, I was proud to make a historic visit uh, to Myanmar as the first uh, U.S. president uh, ever to uh, visit that country. Uh, and now, uh, President uh, San is able to uh, uh, return the favor by making a visit to the United States. And my understanding is that this is the first uh, visit by a leader of Myanmar in uh, almost 50 years. Uh, obviously, during this period uh, in between, uh, there have been significant bilateral tensions uh, between our countries. Uh, but what has allowed uh, this uh, shift in relations is the leadership that uh, President uh, Sain uh, has uh, shown uh, in moving Myanmar down a path of both political and economic reform. Over uh, the last two years, we've seen uh, a steady process in which uh, political uh, prisoners, including uh, Anyang Suu Kyi, uh, have been released uh, and have been incorporated uh, into the political process. Uh, we've seen uh, credible elections uh, and a legislature that uh, is continuing to make strides in the direction of uh, more inclusivity and uh, uh, greater representation of all the various groups uh, within Myanmar. Uh, President Sain has also made uh, genuine efforts to resolve long-standing ethnic conflicts within the country. Uh, and has recognized the need to establish laws uh, that uh, respect uh, the rights of the people of Myanmar. Uh, as a consequence of these changes in policy inside of Myanmar, uh, the United States has been able to uh, relax uh, sanctions that uh, had been placed on Myanmar, and uh, many countries uh, around the world have followed suit. Uh, and this has also allowed the United States and other uh, countries to, uh, uh, and international institutions to participate in engagement with uh, the Myanmar government about how we can be helpful in uh, spurring economic development that is broad-based uh, and that uh, produces concrete results for uh, the people of Myanmar. And that includes the prospect of increasing trade and investment uh, in Myanmar, uh, which can produce uh, jobs and higher standards of living. Uh, but uh, as President Sain is uh, uh, the first to admit, uh, this is a long journey, uh, and uh, there is still much work to be done. Uh, and uh, during our discussions, uh, uh, President Thane uh, 
shared with me uh, the, uh, the manner in which uh, he intends to continue to move forward on uh, uh, releasing more political prisoners, uh, making sure that they, uh, the government of Myanmar institutionalizes uh, some of the political reforms that have already taken place, uh, how uh, rule of law is codified uh, so that uh, it continues into the future, uh, and the process whereby uh, these uh, ethnic conflicts that have existed are resolved not simply uh, by a ceasefire, but an actual incorporation of all these communities into the political process. Uh, I also shared with uh, President Sain uh, our deep concern about communal violence that has been directed uh, at uh, Muslim communities inside of Myanmar. <coughs> uh, the displacement of people, the violence directed towards them uh, needs to stop uh, and uh, we are prepared to uh, work in any ways that we can with uh, both the government of Myanmar and the international community to assure that uh, people are getting the help that they need, uh, but more importantly that uh, their rights uh, and their dignity is recognized uh, over the long term. Uh, as I uh, indicated to President Sain, uh, uh, countries that are successful are countries that tap into the talents of all people uh, and respect the rights of all people. Uh, and uh, I'm confident that uh, if uh, Myanmar follows that recipe, that uh, it will be uh, a, not only a successful democracy, but also a thriving economy. Uh, we also discussed uh, some very concrete projects that we've already initiated. For example, uh, uh, USAID uh, is already working to evaluate how we can improve agricultural productivity uh, in Myanmar uh, that can benefit farmers, increase incomes, uh, and improve standards of living uh, in a largely agricultural country. Uh, and we're also working, uh, for example, on projects like uh, uh, improving the road that currently exists between uh, Rangoon and uh, Mandalay. Uh, finally, I wanted to thank uh, President Sain for uh, his participation uh, in ASEAN uh, and the East Asia Summit in which the United States uh, is actively engaged uh, in uh, all the countries in Southeast Asia as part of our broader uh, refocusing on uh, the Asia Pacific region, uh, a region of enormous growth uh, and potential uh, with which uh, we want to continue to uh, strengthen our bonds. Asia Pacific So, uh, Mr. President, welcome uh, to the United States of America. We very much appreciate uh, uh, your efforts uh, and leadership uh, in leading uh, Myanmar uh, in a new direction, and we want you to know that uh, the United States uh, will uh, make every effort uh, to assist you uh, on what I uh, no is a long and sometimes difficult, uh, but uh, ultimately uh, correct path to follow. Washington, D.C., but my own day, Yahoo, the White House, 
I would like to express my sincere thanks to President Obama for inviting me to come to the United States. Indeed, this is my very first visit to Washington, D.C., as well as to the White House. And I'm also very pleased to have this opportunity to discuss about the democratization process and reform process undertaken in my country. Our two countries established diplomatic relations since 1947, a year before our independence, and since then we have been uh, able to enjoy, historically our two countries have enjoyed cordial relations, and there were also exchange of high-level exchange of visits between our two countries. But I have to say that in the past there were difficulties or difficulties in our uh, bilateral relationship. But, but now we are very pleased that our relations have been improved uh, significantly and I'm very thankful that in 50 years I'm paying a visit to the United States at the invitation of President Obama and I'm very grateful for extending an invitation to me to pay a visit to the United States. Now that our country, <coughs> Myanmar, is started to practice democratic system, so we can say that we, we have, uh, both our countries have similar political system in our two countries. As you all know, our government is just, our democratic government is just two years old. And we have, within the two year, short period of two years, our government have carried out political and economic reforms in our country. Because we are in a very nascent stage of democratic, a democratic stage, we still need a lot of experience, democratic experience and practices to be learned. And we have, we have seen successes. At the same time, we have been encountering obstacles and challenges along our democratization path. The improvement in our relation is also in recognition, the U.S. government's recognition of our democratization efforts and our genuine efforts for democratization process in our country. And it is also due to thanks to the President, Ob President Obama's re-engagement policy to re-engage with our country so that we have seen improvement in our bilateral relations in the, within a short period of time. ကျွန်တော်တို့ကွန်ပြူးစားကျွန်တော်ကွန်ပြူးစဲနိုင်ငံတင်တနင်ငံနေနဲ့လို့ကိုကျွန်တော်စနစ်ကိုကြောင်း
developing country and as we are undertaking changes or democratization uh, reforms, it is a daunting, uh, daunting task ahead of us. We encounter many challenges, such as at present, our poverty rate in the country is quite high, and we have very few job opportunity, and then as well as we, have, uh, we do not have much uh, middle class in our country, and then we stay, uh, our people need to uh, be more familiar with democratic practice, uh, democratic norms and values. So we have a lot of challenges ahead of us. But we have to thanks to, thanks to the uh, US government and the people's support and the understanding that we will be able to encounter these challenges as we undertake the reform process in our country. <laughs> นอร์เวย์ကျွန်တော်ဒီတရားဥပဒေဆုံးမှုအပိုင်းနေနောက်ရဲ့တို့တတ်တွေ့ရဲ့ဒီအရေအသွေးတွေကျွန်တော်မြ